Hi there, people. As you can see, this is Play Minecraft the PlayStation 3 edition. If you had seen my previous video, uh, the one that I played on the, P the PC on my aging laptop, which was not really very good. It was uh, <laughs> quite jerky. Um, you would have heard me say that I will be starting a new series on the PlayStation 3 edition of Minecraft. Uh, what I will be doing first is changing my skin because what I'm... Obviously, I've done all this beforehand but to kind of see what I could do. I've changed options and whatever, so that's all done. Um, this is what comes with the PlayStation 3 version of Minecraft, <laughs> basically. Um, these are default skins. You've got Basic Steve. Ta -ta. You've got Tennis Steve. A Tuxedo Steve. Athlete Steve. Also seems to be black for some reason. <laughs> Why, I don't know. <laughs> uh, Scottish Steve, who seems to be a really pale ginger person. Why, I don't know. <laughs> let's, uh, yeah, let's be very stereotypical. Uh, Prisoner Steve, a Cyclist Steve, Boxer Steve, and Normal Steve. That's the one that's selected so far. Uh, favourite skins that are not in there because I haven't picked any favourites, obviously. Festive Steve. Now, this one, there are some locked. As you can see, there's a lock there where it's next to Santa. But you can be Mrs. Claus for some reason. You can't be Santa, but you can be Mrs. Claus. So, there you go. Uh, let's see. This is kind of the same with uh, the Vita version. Um, you can choose basically to be certain skins. There are some preset skins in there. Uh, you can be present, uh, a, a present, uh, <laughs> um, Christmas tree is lot. It can be a Christmas pudding, uh, zombie turkey, robin, bad Santa, or you can be a gingerbread man or woman. Not sure what the difference is there, but looks a bit more icing on one. Scrooge. Oh, hello. Uh, Okay, he seems to want to do a bit more than just spin around. Marley's Ghost, which kind of seems a bit... Uh, ooh, bum 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 chicka bum bum wicka chow wicka chow bum wicka chow wow. And back to Sancho again. Uh, Battle and Beasts. Now, this is uh, the Battle and Beasts pack. It can be Enderman in a suit. Well, you can be if you unlock them, obviously. Uh, a Cave Spider in a suit, which uh, seems strange. Okay, you can stop that now. Uh, chicken in a suit, zebra, panther, warthog, mandrill baboon. <laughs> Oi, er, baboon! Uh, a meerkat. Hmm. A rhinoceros, hippopotamus, elephant. Blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to go through them all. Oh, gnu. <laughs> hey, gnu. I don't know what's a gnu with you. So you got you got all these different skins. Uh, like I say, these are automatically like loaded in. The the ones with the padlock, like I say, you will need to uh, to unlock. As in, like go to the Microsoft Store and unlock. Uh, there's some you got Knight Templar. Da, 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 da. Uh, oh, skin pack. Th no, 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 no. What are you doing? Skin pack one. Thank you, no Templar. Um, so basically, yeah, like I say, there's uh, there is a lot. And you got these kill zone uh, skins. Understandably, in a way, you know, you would need to unlock these, such as that one that's from Sly Cooper, uh, Salcom, Heavy Rain, and so on and so forth. You could, like I say, you just go into the store and. Uh, Oh, well, you can be racing driver. 
You can be racing driver number four. No, you can be racing driver number four. I'm racing driver number four because I'm number one. No, I'm number one because I'm racing driver number four. And if you understand that reference, well done. Uh, so, ooh, they can be a king or a queen. Yeah. But not the jester, can I? Uh, Battle and Beasts 2, there's uh, a lot more there, da, 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 da. I'm not going to go through all these because I'm just going to be, I'm just going to be, oh, Castaway. Oh, Yamato from, uh, Yamato from Everybody's Golf. Everybody's Golf! Uh, oh, oh, Half-Life and uh, Jack from Jack and Dexter. There's Dexter from Jack and Dexter. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, Alex, oh, the G, you can be the G man. There's Portal 2. Oh, there's Shell from Portal. Dr. Rosenberg. Dr. Rosenberg. Oh, Left 4 Dead 2. Bit Trip Runner. And enough for that. So, so anyway, um, which one shall we go for? Um. I mean, I can't just play with basic Steve, really, can I? I mean, I need, I need to play as some other Steve. Uh, I shall go with Tuxedo Steve. There we go. So that's all that done. <laughs> and let's play a game. As you can see, start game, create new world. I could download the PS Vita save because uh, my daughter played on the PSV, PS Vita version and I could download her world and play that but no, I'm going to create a new one. Now this is one thing as well you need to look at. These are the texture packs. Now what you need to remember is if you choose such as the city texture pack and then you go to create the new world it will say trial texture pack this is something i didn't see before and i was kind of asking on uh, twitter you know what's going on so uh, we shall start with the classic minecraft textures uh, we don't really need these silly ones although the plastic texture pack looks a bit uh, Funky. Oh, yeah, you, I just noticed you get a, a thing. The city texture pack. Not really sure if that one's a, a creative texture set. Ideal for building structures, the perfect set for the focused build. Okay. Well, anyway. Uh, what, what, what should we call this? Uh, um. Let's call it World of World of MG. There we go. So that that, that will do. Right. Uh, oh, why was it on that pack when I bought it? Oh no, I've got a... Thank you, yes, we want that one. Well, you've got difficulty, peaceful, easy, normal, hard. Now, we'll just... Nice and easy. Let's check the... Uh, Online game? No. Uh, player versus player? No. Trust player? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Host privileges? No. Super flat? Oh, bonus chest. Yes, we'll have that. And so here we go, let's create a new world. Party was excellent. Lava and contact means to disappear completely when the source block is removed. Ah, okay. Some animals will follow you if you have wheat in your hand. Yes, well, that's the thing with... Uh, yes. 
Breeding cows, that's one of the... Uh... Oh, hello. Oak wood. Chopped using an axe and can be crafted into planks or used as fuel. Thank you for that information. Oh, hello. Spruce leaves, when broken, sometimes drops a sapling which can then be replanted to grow into a tree. Any more information? No? Okay. Wow, I've got to say, <laughs> seeing this like this. Oh my god. So, right. Uh, let's make our way out of here. What? A torch? Why is there a torch? Um, oh, hello. A chest. Oh, and I appear to have picked up a torch as well. Uh, for some reason. <laughs> Don't know why, it just... Right, I press L2 to open. Ooh, resources. Oh, hello. What, what have we got in the inventory? Oh, a map. Okay. Well, we'll put that there because we'll want to look at that in a moment. Some oak wood planks. Those will come in rather handy. Some oak wood. Ooh, stone pickaxe. Which I shall place in there. Wooden pickaxe, well, I'll leave that there. A stick, that will come in handy for something. Ooh, cocoa beans, I will place there. Pumpkin seeds, which I'll place there. More pumpkin seeds, which I'll add to those. Um, don't think we really need cactus. Mushrooms could come in handy, because I think you can eat those. Well, that's nice. I'll just join the game and there's a chest there with stuff. Well, thank you for that. Oh. Huh. Civilization dawns. Well, that was rather nice, wasn't it? I've already gained a torch, a map, and a pickaxe. Ah, right. This will uh, document my travels. Yes, it will. <laughs> Don't argue with me. Let's see. Will this any information? No. Oh, a grass block. What the? Uh, sometimes produces weeds. So, what's this? A wolf. Docile until attacked. Uh, yeah, I didn't finish reading that because he just looked. He just looked at me. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, whoops, and there's a, a, a drop there. Whoa, what the? Is it? Pig! Drops pork chops when killed. Can be ridden by using a saddle. Yeah, I kind of guessed that by when I was looking. Oh my god, shut up! Jeez, <laughs> let's go over here. Uh, okay, so. The right uh, analog button is that. Left analog button is crouch. Oh, there's. Uh, what, what's that pig doing up there? Okay. Uh, oh. Do 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 can be mined with pickaxe to collect cobblestone. Well, that seems to be a rather deep mine. And I think I can see what may, uh, may be a, a creeper or, or something. No, it's a zombie, I think. So I'm not going to go down there. Uh, go, go, oh, go down there. Go down, go down, go down, go down. I'm not going to go down there at the moment. Uh, I need to investigate further first. I mean, I'm just stuck in the middle of nowhere with a bunch of animals and uh, some rather deep ravines. So, 
No, that's a rather precarious place to put pigs, isn't it? <laughs> How are pigs gonna get from there? R really? Oh, chicken. Hello. Drops feathers, also randomly lays eggs. Yeah, those pigs are pretty much knackered. I was going to use another word there, but no. I want to keep it PG-13. Uh, what's this? Ah, ice. Okay. Slippery when walked on. Turns into water if above another block on the store. Melts if close enough to... Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Oh, okay. So we've got ice. Na 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 And I can see a cow over there. Let's see what it says for cows. Drops leather when killed can also be milked with a bucket. I think I need more than a bucket. You actually need to oh sand collected with a shovel. Can be smelted into glass. Yada yada yada. Is affected by gravity if there's nothing underneath it. Yeah, I kind of... Uh, ooh! Ooh! Hello! Hello! Ah! <gasps> now, the thing is... This doesn't seem... Well, the settings on this don't seem to be much different to... What I've got on the, the PC, I've got like, the fancy settings and whatever. Mind you, to be fair, uh, when I'm not recording, the game does run kind of okay. Not as well as this though, and this actually looks. Whoa, what the? Uh. What was that? Wow. Oak plants. Uses building material. Blah, 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 blah. Hello! Uh, wooden door. Okay. What the? What? Is there something in there? Uh... Gravel collected using. Oh, okay, well. A glass pane. Ta da! Okay. A table. What? Oh. What is that noise? Something. It sounds as if it's like right next to me. Honestly, I mean, I've got my headset up. You can probably tell by my voice, I've got my headset on. Oh my god, can I punch him in the face? Well, I can, but I'm not going to. <laughs> uh, that was rather strange, though, when it... When I like, discovered the village, it kind of... Wow. Uh -huh. Villagers will offer to sell items to the player depending on their profession. Okay, what has he got? Uh, this is the trading interface which displays trades that can be made with a villager. Press X to learn more about the trading interface. Um, all trades that the villager is willing to make at the moment are displayed on the top. Trades will appear red and be unavailable if you don't have the required items. The amount and type of items you are giving to the villager are shown in the two boxes on the left. And excuse me while well, I just turn the game sound down because the villagers are starting to pay me off. Right, okay. <laughs> you can see the total number of the items required for the trade in the two boxes on the left. Uh, press X to trade items with the villager. Right, so basically, uh, he's offering an emerald. We need 18 wheat. And I don't have 18 wheat. Crops, when fully grown, blah, 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 blah. Uh, hello! No, I'm this way. Hello. What is it? Uh, L2. Ooh! A diamond axe, efficiency 2, unbreaking 2. Required items, 
and Diamond Axe and Emerald. So we will basically enchant an axe for me. He wants coal. Oh, hello. Here's another one. He offers bread for an emerald. Uh, he offers shears for three emeralds. Oh, stone stairs. Hello. Used for compact staircases. Uh, he offers flint and he wants ten gravel and an emerald. Some of them ask, you know, pretty high prices. You know what I mean? Uh, oh, there's the moon. It looks like it's becoming night time, so I need to get out of it. Oh, hello. That's rather funky. Iron bars. Used as a barrier. Iron bars! Reptile. No, that's still bars. I'm not going to sing anymore. Michael Bolton, I'm very sorry indeed. Furnace allows you to smelt or create charcoal and glass. Cook and fish pork chop. Oh, a pressure plate to send an electrical charge when stepped on. Plate cross will be activated. Blah blah blah. And this pressure plate does nothing because it's it's acting as a table. Ooh, what we got in it? Ooh, hello. Can I have those iron leggings? Thank you. <laughs> uh, ooh, there's some uh, iron in there. Iron ingots, which I'll need to make more. An iron pickaxe, which I'll. Uh... Oh, obsidian! Oh, hang on, what's this? Obsidian can only be mined with a diamond pickaxe. It's produced by the meeting of water and still life. Oh, of course! Yes, obsidian. Yeah, I know what that is. Uh... And I get the feeling that that banging. Yeah, as you can probably hear, is uh, <laughs> the sound of zombies. Yep, there's a zombie. Yep, there's a zombie. Go away, zombies. Oh, I've got the uh, the iron the iron pickaxe in the event that uh, in the event one of them tries to attack me. Come at me, bro! The reason, I'm little, uh, the reason I'm a little bit worried about this is the fact that there's, uh, there's no door. <laughs> no, there, there appears to be a lack of doorway. <laughs> oh, is that, that looks like a spider or something else. So, yeah. Um, because of the distinct lack of a door, uh, <laughs> This is why I'm hiding, which I think would be quite uh, an obvious thing to observe. And uh, okay, well, <laughs> I'm gonna leave the. Oh shit! What's that? What the? Is that a sheep? What? What's a sheep doing there? It can be dyed to make its wool a different colour. Okay. Uh, I am going to leave it there. Um, oh, auto saving in 3, 2, 1. Auto save! Oh! Yeah, you didn't really need to go through all that just to auto save. You could have just done the little icon thing at the top right there. That would have been sufficient. So, as I was going to say, <laughs> I will leave that there. Uh, this episode, this first episode of my uh, PlayStation 3 Minecraft uh, new series of videos. Um, in the next video, I will 
attempt to uh, to venture outside and say just who or what is banging on the doors. But until then, um, please like uh, the video uh, to s so that I will know that people are watching this and will want to see more. And if you want to see more, please subscribe for more. And uh, I will see you next time. Thanks for watching and bye.